everyone today in this video we'll be discussing the module 2 super important question uh, which is uh, regarding the facade and we have to explain it using an example and the diagram okay so before starting make sure the like button subscribe my channel for more videos like this and without wasting any more time let's get started the question can be as follows uh, define facad pattern and explain with a diagram what is facad facad is nothing but an intermediary okay there is clients here there is a uh, um, the system here okay and between the client and the system there is a facad here now what is the need for the facad Library class that provides a set of methods for the interface and thus serves as a single point of entry and exit from the business logic module. From the business logic till the library, there is a single point of entry. This point of entry is known as facade. Okay. In the language of design pattern, it is known as facade. And uh, the primary motivation behind using a facade is to reduce the complexity between the uh, communications from the system and the clients. Okay, the clients will send some requests, and the client does not understand the complexity of the subsystem, and the subsystem does not understand the complexity of the uh, like what high level language the client is trying to tell it. Okay, so to minimize the communication gap between them, we'll be using a facade. So let's have a look at how it works. It not only shields the client from the complexity, but also enables loose coupling between the subsystem and its client. So it makes it more flexible and freely. It's not typically designed to prevent the client from accessing the components in the subsystem. Client can still access the subsystem, but it will just uh, do it in a more freer manner. So that's what uh, this is about the facades and this is the diagram you have to make. Here two clients are there which are trying to access the subsystem, but in between they have to access through it to the facad. And facad has the uh, classes also uh, all involved. That is the whole thing is called a subsystem and they will be accessing it through the facad. That's all what you friend. Make sure to like button, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.